Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is a power 3 minus b power 3 is equal to 61. To find the value of a plus b, so that a comma b is element of a natural number. Now, we know that natural number, it is like 1, 2, 3, and so on. So, to find a plus b, from this uh, problem here, a power 3 minus b power 3, this is same as a minus b bracket times a square plus ab plus b square bracket, which is equal to this 61. Now, in here, we have multiplication of this times this. Now, from this 61 is a prime number, whereas 61 is multiplication of either 1 times 61 or 61 times 1. Now, between these choices, the relation between this times this, a minus b, here we have subtraction. So, a minus b, it is less than this because here we have addition and here addition. So, this a minus b, it is less than a square plus a b plus b square bracket now if this is less than this one is less than 61 so the relation between this and this for this it is okay but for this 61 it is greater than one which is not corresponding to this relation so this one will reject this choice so when we compare it will be a minus b is equal to 1 so a minus b is equal to 1 and here a square plus a b plus b square is equal to 61 so here a square plus a b plus b square is equal to 61 then from these two equations in here we make a the subject so into here We'll take this negative b to the right side. So it will be a is equal to 1 plus, here we'll take negative b to this side to b plus b. So we we'll substitute the value of a which is 1 plus b into here and here. So from a square, a it is this 1 plus b. So it will be 1 plus b, then bracket this square plus a it is this. So 1 plus b bracket times this b then plus this b square is equal to this 61 then in the next step the square of 1 plus b it will be 1 square it is 1 then plus 2 times 1 times b it is 2b then plus b square then plus here b times 1 it is b plus b times b is b square then plus this b square is equal to this 61 then in the next step we start with b square so b square plus b square plus b square is 3b square then with b 2b plus b is 3b so it will be plus 3b then plus this 1 is equal to this 61 then we take this 61 to the left side so it will be this which is 3b square plus 3b this 61 we take to this side to be minus 61 so 1 minus 61 is negative 60 is equal to 0 now this quadratic equation is divisible by 3 so we'll divide the whole equation by 3 now 3b square divided by 3 it is b square then positive 3b divided by 3 it will be plus b negative 60 divided by 3 it is negative 20 is equal to this 0 then from this quadratic equation this can be solved by grouping and factorization so it will be b square then plus b because here we have 20, here plus b is same as plus 5b minus 4b. 
5b minus 4b it is b then minus this 20 is equal to 0 then in the next step in here b it is common so we'll take b out of bracket b squared divided by b it is b plus 5b divided by b it is 5 bracket in here we'll take negative 4 out of bracket negative 4b divided by negative 4 it is positive b negative 20 divided by negative 4 it is positive 5 bracket is equal to this 0 then from here b plus 5 is common so we'll take b plus 5 bracket out of bracket this divided by this it is b negative 4 times b bracket b th plus 5 this divided by this it is this negative 4 bracket it is equal to 0 now from here we have two solutions whereas this first solution b plus 5 is equal to 0 and this second solution b minus 4 is equal to 0 then from here we'll take 5 to the right side it will be b is equal to negative 5 and here we'll take negative 4 to the right side it will be b is equal to 4 now from these values of b we'll recall the condition from our problem a comma b is element of a natural number whereas natural number is from 1 2 3 and so on now here b it it should be positive number from 1 and so on so this negative 5 is not natural number so we'll reject this solution now we already get the value of b which is 4 now to get the value of a we we'll recall from here a is equal to 1 plus b so from a is equal to 1 plus b then it will be a is equal to 1 plus b it is 4 so it will be equal to 5 so this is value of a which is 5 b is 4 now in our problem we are asked to find the value of a plus b so it will be equal to a it is 5 then plus b it is this 4 so it will be a plus b is equal to 5 plus 4 it is 9 therefore this is the final answer for the value of a plus b in this our problem thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye